And if you're wondering, how can I be wearing this at the beach right now? Remember I told you everything was going to change after Labor Day. Yes. Obama expects to win with 27% of the vote. Are you serious? Yeah. Obama expects to win with 27% of the vote? Yeah, and that, he said that his obvious strategy is that he's going to piss off everybody in the nation have a third party form, they'll split off the Republican vote, and then he'll win on the liberal vote because uh, he decided to take health care to the Supreme Court immediately, so that they said that he, he wins no matter what the decision is. He said if he gets it, the liberals support him. If he doesn't get it, he blames it on the Republicans, and they're trying to destruct the Yeah, come, 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 come. Wow, can you believe that? Look how far it's coming up. Oh my gosh, and the market is up. Oh yeah, as well as the tide is up on low unemployment number that the ex experts admit are a fraud. Well, yeah, they said they they it will be changed uh, next week when they do the end of the month thing. But right now, it looks like the, uh, you know they set a record with uh, a one week reduction in people filing for unemployment. So all they did was they jiggered the figures to not include people that aren't that are filing for unemployment until next week. Oh really? And Obama's top political advisor stark words about the 2012 chances. Well he said Obama basically is standing, he really did say Obama is standing against the entire nation and expects to win re-election. He said the left doesn't want him, the middle doesn't want him, and the right hates him. So it's a very difficult way to get reelected. So do you call him an optimist or delusional? No, they still expect him to win. Okay. Really? The polls all show Herman Cain leading. And well, I'm talking, not only Herman Cain, Ron Paul can now beat him by six points. They don't want this man as president. No one wants him. The black voters, well, they're going to, as they hear, I love this, uh, they got dealt. Well, they're going to go back and vote for that man because if they don't vote for that man, they're going to get a Republican. And this is a white guy from the North speaking like uh, Stanford. And study finds low graduation rates among? Okay, basically those are those Hispanics that they're forcing into college. They can't go full time because uh, they have to do other things. They don't tend to graduate like the government says they do. Oh. They, they all show that they don't graduate. And Democrats think we have too much democracy and that not having elections in 2012 would be best for the nation to help end the gridlock. Oh yeah, we, we suspend the next presidential election until 216. We have no federal or state elections in 212 because that will, that will solve the problems in our nation. And they, they're saying, well, this was a joke. We didn't mean any of it. No, they meant every word they said and didn't realize there were people with, with uh, reporting what they were saying. You have to understand, there are Democrats that do not like this president. And they're in every really? audience that he goes to. I mean, he went to a, a supposedly an audience here in Southern California that worships the Johnny Oh, and the heckler. And they heckled him <laughs> because they don't want him as president. And shipwreck carrying treasure trove of silver believed found. Well, it's supposed to be the largest treasure trove ever found. Not if it's silver, it won't be. You can't carry enough silver to a price to have ever amounted to, you know, a billion dollars. Well, you know, if you compare silver versus gold prices, come yeah, on. That's right, but they're saying it's to be the largest treasure trove ever found. Maybe of silver. Yeah, in silver, but not the largest treasure trove. And protesters march in Manhattan criticizing Wall Street. Yeah, and almost all of them are fat cats there. you got Michael Moore, who made, who's made uh, you know, mm. close to a billion dollars. You have Susan Sarandon. You, you know, you have people that are basically yeah, and did you hear all of that? We had a helicopter as well as a jet flying over know, an airplane. I know. <laughs> yeah, but here's here's Michael Moore sitting there talking about how bad capitalism is. And they're sitting there going, wait a minute. Didn't 
you make money because of capitalism yeah, for all your movies? Remember, the people, the socialists at the top of the food chain believe in capitalism for them and not for anybody else. Oh, is that what it they is? They like to make money off of the people beneath them. So you're not going to see Michael Moore writing a check to the government for higher. So I, I think I'm being, I'm not paying enough taxes. So I think I'll give you a hundred million dollars. That's not happening. Well, but they can I'm always give more money. Talking to people. You know, well, did you did you write a check out last year for more? Well, no, I didn't because, you know, it's it's important that we so you know that we do this and we do that now. We said, but did you write a check out? Yeah, okay. And he said, I have a blank check here. You can write a check out now to the federal government, and this check will be honored. And they said, well, no, I'm waiting for the other for the other people to come on board with this plan. And he said, in other words, you're a, and basically they, they did the, you know, the God blank and a hypocrite. And he said, I am not a hypocrite. And he said, find the goddamn check. And then he said, well, I won't do it until other people do it. <coughs> See, that means he's a hypocrite. Yep. Yeah. And Obama seeks to show up black support and jobs pushed by insulting them. I didn't know that. Whoa! Well, I mean, he kind of, you know, get off your blankety blank, 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 blank asses and get out there and support me. Because... Yeah, you know, those blankly blank 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 blank. He likes to go into four letter words when he thinks he's not on. You know, when okay, what happens is when Obama gets off of the teleprompter, Obama has a foul mouth and a mean disposition, and he doesn't care who he's in front of. He feels that these people are not properly supporting. You know, first of all, he's not a black man. He's no more black than I am white, folks. I love looking at these waves coming up over you. Oh wait, well not coming up over you, in back of you. Yeah, sometimes. Yeah. And Washington State gunman shot dead after firing near school field. Yeah, I mean, it, it, it's... I mean, it, just like my father said, nobody ever, no prejudice. What? It said that happened. Well, what happens, of, of course, if you're going to fire, don't fire near a school. That's right. And uh, beef, beef bound for Georgia schools recalled over E. coli okay. worries. I don't understand. I mean, you know that if you get caught, you're going to lose tens of millions of dollars. And it's a hell of a lot cheaper to inspect your food than spend tens of millions of dollars. They just got Tyson foods over it. I, I, I know. It, it's just ridiculous. You don't waste, you don't lose tens of millions of dollars because you don't want to spend a, a couple of thousand dollars a month for an inspector. It's just ridiculous. It's not a good thing. But you have to understand who owns all of these plants. Hmm. Democrats. And cantaloupe listeria illnesses and deaths expected to rise. Well, yeah, when you, basically you're using gray water to grow things in, folks. I mean, they've got... Uh, I think like 18 and 19 have died now and more. Like they're telling people basically don't buy don't buy cattle up in Colorado. The problem is you don't know where they're from because they're it's only marked on the boxes. When they're coming. Well, that's why you can get a really good price for cantaloupes right now. Yeah, but yeah. I touch one of them. Al Qaeda slams Iran over 9/11 conspiracy theories. Oh yeah, they're, uh, they're truthers. Iran, they said that they they you know we killed all these people. We did it. And no, George Bush had nothing to do with it. Well, that's right. Mm -hmm. What happened was, it went back to, I've explained it before. You had some standard building And personal assistant and guard testify in Michael Jackson case. Well, you know, we just missed all this nonsense. It's a ridiculous trial because the guy is going to get a four-year suspended sentence and loss of his law license and fifty thousand dollars fine. I know, and they're going through all of that. My God! I know it's ridiculous because he's already got a license to practice in another state already. A report: Venezuela's Chavez in hospital for emergency care. Well, they think he's dying. They said that he is. Uh, he's he looks terrible. He's cut back. He used to drink like 60 cups of coffee a day. He's cut back to no coffee. He's, uh, he can't control his weight no matter what he's doing now. That's generally a sign. They said his kidneys have failed. The radiation basically damaged his kidneys, so he's dying. And they're gonna. They said, well, the Obama administration, we can't afford to have Chavez die, so we're we're offering, you know, the best in American medical care, which Obama says we don't have. We have the best medical care in the world. 
world and we'll bring Hugo Chavez here to he says we don't have good medical care. And a Monty bubbleism from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. No. You know you're getting old <laughs> when uh, someone that you've worked with as an adult and they and they were a child just turned fifty.